Welcome back to Shadow Gambit. We're halfway through Pincus's quest. Uh, let's Maybe take on right. the next challenge. Where to, navigator? So we need to go to the Grand Alcazar to bury the remains of his servant. Ah, such a formidable church that there appears to be no confessor in sight. Confessor? Why should we concern ourselves with such lowly? They are trained to perform the Maiden's judgment, to see that it is done properly. I have spied one at the gardens. It seems he has taken a stroll. Does my lord think that he could take a peek into that confessor's mind, to learn about the Maiden's judgment? Learn? A fond press fond, never! Quartermaster. Oh, well, as usual, only the best for my servants. Avia, uh, would you kindly choose an appropriate landing again? Let's go nearby. This seems good. The tower base. Doesn't look like there's too many enemies there. So let's go with... Uh, well, obviously we need Pincus. I think Selene would be good for this mission. And also Teresa. Chapter in my memoirs. Uh, Sebastian, are you certain that you don't want me to say some words of my own when we send you off? I would like it to be a bit more mm, sacerdotal than your usual ramblings, my lord. Ah, Sebastian, what you denote as rambling? This is my renowned ability to rally crowds. My lord surely is referring to the time he rallied his sister's wedding party. Yes, of course. The crowd was so enraptured after my speech. Yes. Your sister was very glad you reminded everyone that her spouse was going to be her third attempt at marriage. How far do you and Pinkas go back, Sebastian? I've seen to Pinkas since he was born. Sebastian was the only servant who remained loyal after the von Presfalt estate fell to bankruptcy. Now he is working for the honor of serving our house. My lord, I have followed you under the impression that you would at least attempt to repay me for my services. Ah! Timeless I did. Thunder. It's just that there were so many other necessary expenses to be covered. Hmm. Like the cakes coated in gold foil? Yes. Now, let me see. A grand many things to say and do. It seems that usually for this procedure they use the beacon of judgment. But this confessor has a lousy memory. He doesn't remember any of the things he is supposed to say. He just reads them off one of those iron slabs that are stored in the scriptorium. Do you think we could acquire such a slab to assure that the words uttered at my judgment are in accordance with the Maiden's teachings? Certainly, Sebastian. Additionally, equipment to ignite the beacon is to be found close by. And some iron dust to sprinkle on the remains should be taken as well. These seem to be all the things. Let's get them swiftly. So, let me continue my musings. Especially those. Okay, so it's all over there. Time is moving fast. Do so we need to make our way around? You never cease to amaze, Marley. Coming right up. Could be tricky. Cover seeds. Ugh, it's not like a font press to hide in such thickets. The fire hungers for us. 
Oh, I can grow lots of things. Oh, I like that. Mm -hmm. How Come in through. this? Okay, getting there. Smoking right. Just make sure we're all hidden in the bushes here. Ugh. Okay, that's fine. Just a quick save. Way back. Just a dash. Lady at the red. okay, this is gonna be interesting. Let's go to Yeah, let me uh, see. What they say. Let's get a better view. Oh, well, oh, Strange. Ah, ah, pirates! Well off. What ails your soul? Ouch! Okay, that's just. <laughs> I was trying to get myself out of there, but that's just a reload. Oh, we, we're back here, are we? Okay. Good snout. Well now. What ails your soul today? Hmm. We could go. I guess. Oh no, we got you as well. All right. This is. Yeah. It's not a. I have to, let's cover this. Nobody up. abandons their post. The verdict is clear. Is Who needs eyes to see? Once more unto the green slash. Okay. Okay. I think we're good the here. Lady at the red. Um. Let's just do that. And we'll wait on. Wait on that. Hopefully we're fine here. As long as I don't cut the corner. In the land of the blind. It's done. A nice little uh -huh. well okay. Ah, let's stretch That's those fine. Ah, nose from the ground. Trouble is brewing. All right, easy fix. Well now. Why did that? <sighs> oh, back here again! Oh my god, that's so annoying! Uh, annoying for getting to uh, to save like that. Um, why did that guard get get alert so quickly? That's very strange. What? Ooh, that was close. Oh, no, there was no Take a walk. Yeah, this guy uh, became uh, alarmed so quickly. I don't know why that that was the case. Anyway, let's try again. Do a quick save. Filed for review. Ash and judgment. Ah, more target practice. Fate be our judge. Flame guides me this way. Six grams of death root. Two Let's cover this. Well, let me return to my post. Oh. Teresa, para servirlo. Let's what? get a better view. Is that? I feel the curse approaching. Let's hope not. Not today. Please, Baba. Okay, you're going to take him out. Gonna distract you. Still breathing. Still safe. Hmm. The flame. Rodaran cabeza. Ay, thinkers. Flame pretend. Oh my goodness. Okay, so we've got thinkers uh, set up there with a the uniform. Let's see what we've got through and here. You are still certain that you want to do this. You know you'll always have a place at my side, Sebastian. That is very kind, my lord. But I've made my peace with the maiden. Now I just want to bask in her glory. Mm, and I thought I knew your type. Type? My lord? I didn't expect that you'd long for the embrace of a centuries-old burn victim. It is funny you should speak to my preferences in these matters, my lord. Funny? How? Didn't your last affair involve a courtier that arguably was a cousin of yours? Ah, yes. I always struggled to untangle the intricacies of my family tree. Working on it. Let 
Let me just take notes on that one. Yeah, let me add them. I guess it'll do for a hiding spot. Oh, what? Smoking right. Need something, matey. Through the flames. Strange. Hmm. Okay, uh, let's have a look and see who's looking here. You are... Can't quite see. Uh, you are, so we're going to go with... Um, do like this. Right to there, actually. As many as you like. Interesting choice, Marley. Having is better than wanting. <laughs> this is fun. Do each what they deserve. So there is someone patrolling back and forth here. Just, uh, I'll just wait for them to move. Oh, this guy is it? Yes, yeah, that guy. Okay, he's patrolling both courtyards. Well, let's just wait for him to go back the other way. A memory imprint. Sends you away. Flame leads me this way. Is that what? Mm. No cover? Yeah. Easy. Switch oh. shroud. Coming through. Is anymore. that strange? What's this yellow here? Okay, so that arrow might be difficult to get. Um, we've got this guy to worry about as well. We can hide in these bushes. Let's do a quick save. We'll see if we can do that. Can we keep that one for later? Uh, sneaking around the bushes there. Okay, he's watching there. Take out those three. Hmm. Guess we could guess as possible. The court is in session. Let's do a quick save. A little souvenir. That crime somehow. Let's get a what? better view. Well now. Anybody seen my servants? Six grams of death root, two drops of moonshine. Dicho y hecho. It's quickly done. Oh, I see. Yeah, let me add it. The white crow stands ready. Ah, like let's stretch those roots. An anchor in the sea. Hey, try this fruit. I like the taste of it. This was ruined my coat. Oh, oh. Up, I believe it would be much easier to enter the scriptorium in the guise of one of these acolytes. Maybe killing all of them before achieving just that is not the best idea then. Still breathing, come to me. To taste the soul of another. We got our own little pup. All right, easy fix. Okay, so that's fine. What ails your soul today? The verdict is clear. All right, I'll put that down. I've the seen body it. down. 
Uh, we'll deal with the prognostica because we need to do that so we can get the, uh, the item there. Um, but we will do that in a second. Oh, so let's grab you. Lots of you. Need something, matey. Oh, I need this ladder. Uh, yeah. Mm. Another soul for the buyer. Okay, you let's grab this. Take the iron dust. This is the dust. Now, what would one do with a bag of weighty dirt to the funeral? Sprinkling the iron dust of the maiden on the burning pyre symbolizes her willingness to burn alongside us. Hmm. Does the procedure require the entire bag? Yes, my lord. And you may not have one ounce for that pipe of yours. Yeah, I don't think I can attack the prognostica here without could being... Be reminded of the time when we broke into Louis uh, XIV's hurt by these. Pipe. I guess that there, is yes, a, my lord. there is a spot Even right in there death, where I could do it. My back still Maybe. hurts when I think about carrying all those bo um. books out of there. Well, good reading comes to price, doesn't it? Mm. My lord, you never actually read one of them. <laughs> Who'd have thought they'd all be in French? Darn language nobody can make sense of. Change in position. You know what it takes for years of Time waits for no one. Except us. Pitiful creatures. I'm just gonna s I just wanna see if this works, otherwise we will just time that. Fire hungers for us. By your Silence descends. Okay. It's done. Up. Oh. Outside. Oh, where are you going? Just pop it down there. Uh, let's grab the arrow. You can stay there for the moment. Uh, I think us can go and take a look at this. I'll take the iron slab here. Let's see. What does it say? Hmm, iron, fire, burning of a maiden, the voice of the flame, judgment. Again, I'm certain I could muster up words of much greater sacrosanctity. Have you ever given a eulogy before, my lord? Sebastian, surely you haven't forgotten the speech I gave at my uncle. These two are watching Ooh. each other. That was a eulogy? Oh. No one's watching him. I was under the impression that you were attempting to open the buffet. That was a beneficial uh, side effect, I admit. Even in death, Uncle Richard was stingy with the food. I'm spared. Okay, so we'll do that. Working on it. Can sneak through here. Do you like this so far? Just there. We're gonna chop as this down. Many as you like. uh, guess there. Let's cover this up. Incoming. Strange. Above and oh. 56 seconds ago. Okay, well I can get fingers to distract the guy. I there. was under the impression. That you were attempting to um, open the buffet. Let's do that. that was a beneficial That's side right. effect, I admit. Even in death, Uncle Richard was stingy with the food. Surely I can interest someone in a little detail. I do like this. It's all in the loose. I'd like to exert the right of inquiry. Now, what are your duties here? Still breathing. Still sane. Okay, um... So we'll do that, that... Um... Too many weeds here. Fire. Finish. Uh, Not there. Open. Beautiful. And okay, let's grab that. Uh, grab it. 
Take the fire starter. These are the matchsticks? An odd thing to be considered sanctified. They burn with the smallest essence of maiden's fire and are practically inextinguishable. Ah, we could have used such a thing in those oversized tombs in Giza. We had our torches, my lord, until you decided to start a ruckus with the local water. Treatment is spitting monsters. But to think that they ride them around like mere horses. I think we have all the things required. Yes, it seems so. Well then, no more time to waste, I suppose. Let us start the ritual. Okay, let's begin the ritual. We'll use the lady's plant just to make this a little bit easier. Although there are some hedges there, so it's not impossible to do without the lady, but let's make it a bit easier. We can just do that. Got these guys on patrol, this guy watching. The verdict is clear. Uh, I'm gonna do that. The crow flies. Ugh, these are itching. Having is better than wanting. The lady at the ready. Ah, souls from the ground. My sight reaches farther. Okay, let's just save here, take out these two guards. Dead and Pink memorized. Skin. Take the form of one of them, wait for them to get close enough here. Good. My tobacco. Oh, just out of sight, yeah, that was good. Hey, is that my black root tobacco? Okay, okay. The white crow stands ready. This will be good for you. Heart to heart, anyway. The court is in session. Eh? I'll do it. So of course. All right. Easy fix. Your task has ended. Fine. Let's make it count. Bring it. Yes. A bomb. Still just one. Damn it! I can't reload this gun. Okay. Let's go. It's another super difficult mission. Here we are. Indeed we are. Hmm. My lord, are you ready? Uh, yes, uh, of course. Uh, when have I ever not been? Well, there was that one time at your sixth wedding. Oh, please, let's not talk about that one, Sebastian. Hmm. <sighs> Yeah, I wanted to say... Yes, my lord? Uh, never mind. Let's get on with it. Are you ready, Sebastian? I am, my lord. Dearest maiden, bringer of fire who has been judged in our name, hear me and light your beacon. You who have walked this path before, grant us the wisdom of your judgment. I, Pincus von Presswald, bring you Sebastian, who has come to finish the enlightened journey of his life. He asks you to relieve him of his burdens and lays his worldly soul before you. He is ready to be judged, as you have been judged before us. You shall now speak for yourself, Sebastian Hepart. I, Sebastian Hepart. Give myself to the judgment of the fire. May it test the conviction of my soul. And should I be found wanting, let it consume me. Uh, Sebastian, is it... are you... Oh, I see. I have at times, if not always, failed to show proper appreciation for your sacrifices, Sebastian. You were without doubt the finest companion any man could ask for. Today I lay to rest no servant, but my dearest friend, whose memory would be any pirate's greatest treasure. And I count myself among the richest, for it is mine. 
Thank you, my lord. Sebastian? You're back. Did you change your mind? No, my lord. It takes a while to burn a soul in its entirety. Ah, I see. I just thought... For what it is worth, my lord. I am glad I held out a little longer. But it is time now, my friend. May your soul always illuminate the dark. Yours too, Sebastian. Oh. He's gone, Quartermaster. Truly, this time. I uh, understand. I suppose we ought to leave this place then. I like what the change your soul today. All right, let's have a look and see where we need to go. There's one just down there, not too far away. Down. Oh, this is where we just uh, the path we just took earlier, actually. So we have cleared out some of it. So quick save here. Time waits for no one except us. Do that. Dicho y hecho. Death comes to us. Ah, back to the Marley. Experiments away. Okay, and we are gone. So that took us uh, about twenty minutes. Oh, yes. I suppose I ought to visit that mirror again. A ghostly pleasure. Pinkas? Hmm? The mirror is ready for you. Hmm. I assumed it would be. Well, my reflecting friend, what do you think? I can stabilize the mirror a bit longer, so you can attend your hair. Ah, I thank you, Marley. But for today, my personal vanity will rest, and I'll keep my thoughts with Sebastian. That said, if you ever feel the need for a distracting chat, I would not be disinclined. Navigator, we must talk. Come by when you're ready. At your service. Alright, let's send Aphia to the Red now Marley. We're getting somewhere. And we'll continue to follow the clues. Something feels wrong. Can't you sense it? Tell me how I can help. Someone's watching me, probing my mind like needles in my soul. It's in the captain's quarters. Go, navigator. Okay, in the captain's quarters. Okay, it seems to have something to do with the captain's head. We can, of course, continue the uh, crew tales. We'll do that next time. Or oh, the captain's tests. Yes, the presence is coming from here. There's only one explanation then. I see you've caught on at last, abomination. Ignatia, blast it, she's still in there. Navigator, wait. How easy you've made it to spy on me. Now I think it's time to end this charade. Unleash! Oh, it's as I thought. Only a weak slither of Ignatia's soul resides in there. It's still Ignatia. I say we throw her overboard. I have cut off her feeble attempts to probe my mind. She poses no threat to us. Mm, 
Yes, it seems I am confined. Very well, ship. What plans do you have for me now? Oh, what I wouldn't like to do. Years of grief and anguish, repaid a thousandfold. But I will not stoop to your level. I will probe your mind for answers, and then remove your stench from my captain's remains. You're welcome to try, abomination. My walls are thick, and my reserves endless. Don't worry. If the Marley ever gets tired of you, I'll happily chuck you overboard. No second thoughts, eh? Okay, so we can start a crew tale. Let's go and have a look at the logbook. See what else we need to do. Check out the crew. We finished the lady. We finished uh, Pincus's crew tale. Haven't started with Teresa. Started with Toya. Uh, so Teresa and Gail need to begin. Um, I want to find out uh, what happens to this uh, this fish, the ninja fish. Uh, so I guess we'll grab Slice Toya and, dice. and we need to talk to the Mali. Our objective is clear. Ah, oh, the fish. Yeah, the ninja fish is gone. <laughs> the dish takes must be hiding somewhere. Say, Molly, have you seen the fish that was hanging here? I haven't. I can't pay attention to all the inhabitants on my decks at all times. Some skeleton will have moved him then. He is, after all, still my student. The fish is your student? Uh, let this be of no concern of yours, Molly. Well, fish or not, I feel that old Gertrude is longing for sustenance. Could you see that she gets her meal? Most certainly. Okay, well the fish was learning to be stealthy and now um, <laughs> we can't find the fish. So maybe uh, it's learnt its lesson. Um, uh, where's the kitchen? It's down here, isn't it? On my way. Let's go make a meal for Gertrude. Let's stir. Huh? No. That must have been the wind. That ought to do it. The dish is ready. Let's get it to old Gertrude. A refined decision. Ah, uh, Gertrude is uh, the other side, isn't she? She's down okay. here. Have an animal. Ah, oh, Pincus! Not your tobacco again. It is I, Toya, and I've brought you food. Hmm. It smells like food. You must be Toya then. Uh, let me taste it. Ah, soul infused octopus, minced with fennel. What on earth is going on, Toya? It's nothing. No, 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 no. There is no sense lying to me. You've always cooked with your heart in your hand, Toya. Hmm. I've taken on a student. I find it difficult. Ah, you feel ill-prepared, then? In many ways, yes. I understand. My last battle lies many centuries behind me, but I do recall very few things from my training were directly applicable. Adaption. The first rule both in the kitchen and on the battlefield. Something I hadn't considered in a long while. Thank you for reminding me, Gertrude. Hmm? What? I told you, Pincus. I stopped smoking years ago. I understand. I will be going then. Do All right. you have any idea where the rum has right. gone? I'll find the thief. Don't Inspect you the worry. bush in the kitchen. Oh, there? Oh, there? <laughs> Move like water. <laughs> Student? Sensei? Is this a test of patience as well? What? 
How? How did you get here? I've been hiding here for days, holding still in cover, just as you taught me. You walked by me multiple times, not acknowledging me, so I presumed my cover was not worthy of your praise. Mm, yes, of course I noticed you. I only wanted to see how long you could hold still. <sighs> I knew it. And how did I do, Sensei? You are to be commended, student. Your hiding techniques are quite advanced already. Thus, I believe you are ready for your second lesson, the assassination itself. I will demonstrate it on one of our skeleton crew. You will assassinate a crewmate just for my training, Sensei? The skeletons on the Mali are under special protection. None of our attacks can seriously harm them. Now, let me show you how it is done. Okay. Preparing the ingredients. Let's do that. Let's do that. See if the student can follow. Seven cuts. The fight begins. Uh, it has to just be a regular death. attack. A single strike. Oh. Okay, just a regular attack. Ah, oh, seems to work. Did you see? The ending of a life must be swift and meaningful. With doubt comes hesitation, and hesitation is defeat. Do you understand that? I believe I do, Sensei. Belief is not knowing. Not knowing is doubt. Eradicate all doubt. Only then can you strike true. Thank you, Sensei. I will practice diligently. Good. Out there in the real world, your adversaries will not go down so easily. So, as long as there is a sliver of uncertainty left, work with our skeletons. I will heed your advice, Sensei. Um, a good starter. 